I say it's high time we abducted one of these men. Should probably upgrade the ship. Really, really dark brown, and give him a good probing. What do you say? Up for a little fun. Oh, okay. So I guess I checkpointed just at the right moment there. So let's land and do this. Did they just not notice. Now are nope. Okay, they are they are aware. It just doesn't matter. Excuse me, cop. Oh. Why is it compromised? I'm not doing anything. Holy smokes! Aliens! Oh, did the... There's the agent. Come back, you. This is the end of the road. Capiche? Nope, I don't want to cancel it. Alright. We're good. Bring in an agent for questioning. Oh, it has to be a specific one. Well, is there like nobody around for me to brain scan? That's a problem. Excuse me. Excuse me. Nope. Well, maybe I'll, I'll probably be fine. Oh, here we go. Here's a random person. Hello, random person. Give me your thoughts. Good night, John boy. I have activated Hypnoblast Fun. Now you can telepathically turn the humans into mindless minions. They'll follow your every move. Okay, turn an enemy into a brainwashed ally with follow. Follower is armed. It'll protect and fight alongside its new master. Human follower protector can't be harmed by your offensive actions. Get rid of them. Use forget. Got it. How many of these guys can I have? The answer is, it seems like I can only have one. And the other guy just stays confused. Well, it's fine. Can I steal his thoughts? Look at these people. Weak, pathetic. Without us, they'd be toast. Well, I think that's the answer. Let's see, why not just abduct him? Because almost all these missions seem to require stealth. I... This is from the mid-2000s, right? Where everybody wanted to make good stealth games, but nobody quite knew how to do it well. I could take that guy, man that guy, man her. Well, anywho. I like it how the agents are just wandering around the UFO. Maybe they just can't see it? I... that's probably the assumption. Go to hell, Klaatu. You think I'm scared of a three-foot space hamster? I think you should be. Now, we can do this easy, or we can do it hard. Your choice. What do you know about a down Furon scout ship? Oh, what? Sorry, let me put it in baby talk. A flying saucer crashed somewhere or uh, captured. I don't know what you're talking about. Of course not. What do you know about Majestic? I know we're gonna kick your little green ass all the way back to Mars. I'm not! These weapons, where are you making them? How many agents does Majestic have? How many other towns are you in? Son of a... Don't get mad. Get sadistic. I think this calls for the Jumbo Probe. You know, I feel like for something like that, you wouldn't want them to boy. move around. You want it to stop, don't you? Then give daddy what he needs. Damn. Mind control. 
Experiment. Rockwell. Movies. Furon DNA. Area 42. Ah. Prepare to return to the mothership, Crypto. We're going back to Rockwell for the last time. In a second. Hold still, monkey boy. Let me just... Well, that's not as easy, but that's okay. Government government agent abducted. Soviets deny double agent de defection. After rumors of the defection of a high-ranking U.S. official to the communists, Soviet officials have denied everything, stating they would never take a traitor into their ranks. U.S. government spokesman Harry Everyman says nothing but red... Oh, mm, sorry. Nothing but red propaganda. It's not absolute claptrap. Uh, claptrap. Who would want to leave the greatest nation on Earth for the USSR? They don't even have shoes, let alone brand new interstate highway system. Eyewitnesses, however, cited a man in a dark suit and glasses being spirited away by a mysterious figure, whose hunchbacked slouch immediately led them to assume communist involvement. So what would you like to upgrade, you little ball of unbridled aggression? Yeah, by the way, the mind control experiments were real. They were, sort of. Uh, so, effectively, the government was kind of messing around with... I'm not sure if it was all just, like, mind control, but I know they were messing around with, like, psychedelic drugs and a bunch of other stuff in increasingly, like, inhumane ways on people. And they, they have been declassifying it. Like, it's not quite to the extent that this game has, but there was a lot more, like, not great things... That the FBI, I think it was, uh, had been doing to, like, American citizens for quite some time. Yeah, there was LSD. There were some other things. There were definitely some that, like, actually left permanent harm, and that was something that, uh... Oh, we should probably upgrade the saucers so the saucer stops getting wrecked. Let's see. Increases the range of the pulse. That might not be a bad idea. Yeah, let's, let's grab that so I can actually knock things around. <laughs> Unfortunately for me, Shell's just sitting go uh, sitting next to me, oops, eating just madcap amounts of goldfish. And it makes me want them. Alright, so we're done with these. Hmm. Do we want to do some of the random missions or do we keep doing, eh, teenage zombies from outer space? The CIA released cocaine into the South Central LA, supposedly during the Nixon administration. Yeesh. I'm sick and tired of this two bit town. Nothing ever happens. No dancing, no rock and roll. Why, if it weren't for that juke joint down by the river, I'd never get my rocks off. You said a mouthful, Cupcake. There's a whole wide world out there, and we're missing it. But where can we go, Billy? This town's a one-way ticket for wild hearts like you and me. It's tearing me apart! What you need is a new direction. Exactly. A real purpose in life. Freaking A! Ever thought about homeland protection? Home what? Wise up, Romeo. There's a half a billion Reds who'd love nothing better than to rip that varsity sweater right off your back. No kidding. Take this little pamphlet. It'll tell you everything you need to know about protecting your little corner of the country from communist invasion. Thanks a million, Daddy-O. Freaking A. Wow. There goes a real American. A real American dreamboat? Meow. That's the last of them. Must have papered every JD in this stinking berg. And our little film strip? Spooled up and ready to go. The pimply projectionist is none the wiser. <laughs> Won't those kids be surprised when Abbott and Costello turn into Jimmy and Johnny Commie Killer in Real Six? Good work, Agent. And not a moment too soon. We need to be in Santa Modesta yesterday. Don't break for yellow. Read me. Loud and clear. 
I want to play more, like, ridiculous 1950s games. The only ones I can think of off the top of my head are, like, L.A. Noir and Sounded XCOM like Decast. Secret agent man was taking orders from the one in goggles. Want me to blow him up? Thank you, Crypto, but I have a better idea. See the plaza over there by the big screen? The humans drive their carbon combustion transports in, and thence view projected images for the purpose of entertainment. Makes perfect sense. I suggest we beat Majestic at their own devious little game. Let's see. Yes. Are the big. Oh. When I catch you, you're going down. Hey! Hmm. Kind of hard to get a good look at this guy. Oh. Uh, my head. There we go. Let's see. Yeah, the beginnings of the Fallout games are definitely. Uh, they're definitely also 1950s y. I just played a lot of Fallout games over the years. It's super tempting to go back and actually play through one of them again, though. Like, I haven't done one of my Fallout challenges in multiple years now, and I kind of miss it. Ah, leave my... Excellent! I've prepared a special film that I'm sure the audience will love. Be a good boy and pick it up. I'm on it. Sit back and enjoy the following educational presentation from the Furon Empire. As soon as I get... <laughs> Yeah, this is an ex-cop. Okay, gotta defend the projector. Excuse me. Ah! Oh! Nobody the humans are still trying to stop the movie. If you don't prevent them, our efforts will be for naught. And I really hate naught. Okay, unfortunately, I still gotta kill an agent with a cop. I'm pretty sure this is a cop, yes? Only one minute remaining. Keep calm. Hope so. Okay. Are you an agent? Ah! Yes. Nobody ever want to come. Thank you. Don't ever tell you you look like a gray baby Lennon. I think my biggest problem is actually I need to weaken them down. Put me down right away. Oh, I feel so powerless. Well. That was unintentional. Brains! They almost managed to stop the movie! Everyone's a critic! Got it! This is your last chance to stop them, Crypto! I'm doing fine. Your silly bonus objectives are the only thing slowing me down. Get out of here. It's all good for Almost there. Ten Go away. seconds. We're good. Can I watch the movie? Or no, it's mind controlling people. I was kind of hoping we actually could watch something happening. Oh well. Worked out. That was loud. <laughs> Aw, so we don't get to see anything. Hey. Furon flicks hit, hit sticks. Meet the Furons. There's something for everyone. Now in theaters, meet the Furons. Meet the Furons as one hearts and minds of local Rockwellians. You'd think it was a terrible truth, said the concessions manager after a run, of, run on frankfurters and popcorn at the local, latest showing. Local youths agree. It's like hypnotic. Freaking A. This is local teen Billy. Teenage girls are ripping the poodles off their skirts and replacing them with aliens. 
gosh, can you imagine meeting one in real life? Says the 15-year-old Janet. Well, I can still can't believe they send messages to one another instantly, like telegrams. But not everyone is smiling. Pastor Mike's letter to the editor on page 9. In other news, Mayor's still missing. I drowned him in a pool. Or, no, I didn't actually. I don't think I did anything to the mayor. Upgrade, perhaps. No? How about your gun or your abilities? Hmm? I thought I saw something for upgrading the jetpack. But I don't see anything for that. Bit of a shame. Well, do you want to just increase our shields for the time being? Yeah, let's do that. Oh, do I have... Yeah. Okay. What is that a reference to, Shell? Oh, North by Northwest, South by Southwest. Got it. Shell just started laughing. was like, uh. <laughs> that agent seems... Both very concerned and almost more just kind of perturbed by the situation he's in. Like, he doesn't really seem afraid or even stressed out. He's just like, why? I'm letting you off the leash, Crypto. The time has come to escalate this little war against the Majestic. You would definitely be needing a more powerful weapon. I destroy a car using humans. It can hurt you as well if you get too close. Little green, good lord, space creatures. Little green man. Martians, I'm a limitation. Ew, communists. So I got to break a car with a human. Good kids. Never oh. them anyway. How durable is this car? Help! Almost dead. There we go. Okay, so we got the ion detonator. Help! Oh yeah. That kind of works. Oh, I guess I'm just going to run around and shooting things. We should probably just use the lightning, as I feel like that's probably the most efficient system that does not involve me grabbing ammo. And kills the most amount of people all kind of vaguely at once. Okay, it does branch from people to people. It just doesn't electrocute them while they're walking out of the car. Good to know. I'm learning things about this game. You are electric proof from your own car until you've stepped foot outside of it. At which point, God, you're fair game. Can you, uh, stop shouting, little green men? I am most definitely not green. Get out of here. Are all of the women in this universe named Marsha? I wonder if we ever get the point where I can TK a, uh, a car. I hope so. <laughs> Synchronized. <laughs> It works. Well, I'm certainly a lot deadlier than I used to be. Get out of here. Alright, so I gotta destroy some cars. Clear you! You can't excuse me. Drop the pistol! It's like I want my god, I hope. Okay. Let me get rid of all of this. Marsha is a girl's name meaning warlike. Huh. Well, fair enough. Alright, there we go. Now it's time to cause this nasty organization some real damage. 
So I gotta use the ion detonator to kill agents. Pretty sure these guys don't count as agents. Which is unfortunate. So I'm just gonna wander off for a little bit. Here's a here's an idea. Well, that got a number of them. Got more agents. Yes. If you run out of ammunition, use transmog to recharge. You you You're going out of business. Get me. Oh, that's easy. Clear the line. Excellent work, Crypto. Now get to your ship and let's get busy. Space rat. You're Dang. Terminated. Some of those guys have some guns. How does nobody notice the UFO in the yard? It doesn't look like it's disguised or hidden. Well, it's okay. It's time to exterminate the majestic infestation in this town. Okay, Find destroy the building. Find majestic base in this town and destroy it. So destroy a building with a majestic agent. This is the end of the road. Hmm. Oh. Beg me to spare your life. Show me what you got. That gives me some shields back. You're going down. Not the most useful. They want to destroy our way of life. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah, I want to get shields back. Not easy. Do I have to be like this? This is very slow. And it doesn't give me all my my shields back. Well, there I'm dead. I hit B, but I guess it was too late. I didn't know you could pop. Okay, moon rocket disaster. Test flight crashes. Officials blame monkey astronaut. I love the fact that they have a special one of these every single time. Uh, might be using the wrong ability? I don't think so. You just do X, the car flips over. Oh, that's ammo. Wait, so how do I drain to get HP back from my shields? Because I, I thought it was X. I guess so. I don't know. Anyway, latest prototype. NASA's latest prototype suffered engine failure and crashed into the nearby countryside. Fortunately, the only casualty of the crash was the pilot, Bobo the Chimp whose body was swiftly recovered by dark-sided animal welfare volunteers before it could become an eyesore. Speaking to the press, the head of the launch control stated, maybe it wasn't the best idea to simultaneously test an ape's ability to fly a rocket along with measuring its tolerance to Cockeye Jim's Kentucky bourbon. The study is being redesigned to take these factors into account, but inside sources I have a different story. Lights in the sky for the July comes early for Prankster. The bottom right has some prompts. I, yeah, I just, I thought it was X to steal the ammo. Maybe, it, maybe it's Y? I don't remember. I don't spend enough time in the UFO to, like, really get it. It's time to exterminate oh, yeah. the majestic infestation in You're this right. town. You're right. That's what I was doing wrong. Find the majestic base in this town and destroy it. Mission. Yep. Okay, there we go. So I've been taking ammo this entire time. That's why I keep getting killed in this. Because I was pressing X. Which, I mean, still useful. Because, yeah, converts cars into ammunition. Looks like four? Four shots. A destroyed building with a majestic agent. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do that. 
I don't even know how I would do that. Now, can I just hold Y? Nope, I gotta just mash it. That's well, okay. I think I can even pull it off people. Maybe? Maybe not. Or, yeah, I can do it off people. Go. I can abduct people. Okay. They want to destroy our way of Bring it back. Alien and Let's see if I can spot an agent. Are you an agent? Nope. That's a cop. Are you an agent? Nope, that's a cop. Maybe I already killed all the agents. Maybe that's the issue. Help! We're being invaded by Alright. Back to the death ray. Which I should probably upgrade. Okay, excuse me. I need at least a handful of Imperial agents. Let's stop this. It's killer time. Are you... No, that's a soldier. All right. I... This... Okay, this seems like an an agent. Did I say an Imperial? I guess I was thinking Majestic. I've also been... What have I been reading that has... Empires? Too much. That didn't count? Or that wasn't... This guy absolutely looks like a... An agent, though. Yeah, that... That's an agent. There we go. So I guess the guns just don't count. Well, let's just pull some HP back in. This is much... This is much easier now that I actually am paying attention. It would help if the ammo control, uh... And does it fly back into me? No, I have to go over it. Okay. Hi, yes. Yeah, unfortunately I can't convert a whole lot of these over, but that's okay. I would like all of these. Yeah, so gun turrets don't count, but I was using an agent, and we're all good. So now we can switch back over to Sonic Boom, and do horrible things to everything, because it's more effective. That's better. And we're good. 100%. Mysterious Blaze destroys motel. Manager blames alien invaders. Officials blame faulty wiring. In a busy day for both the fire department and conspiracy nuts, local motel was destroyed in an explosion blamed on faulty wiring. The motel manager, however, states, Bad wires don't explain like an a explode like an A-bomb. And that little green man wasn't an electrician. It was aliens. Santa Modesta's newly appointed fire chief, looking sharp in a black suit and dark glasses, stated, it's clear the motel's wiring had decomposed, creating hallucination-induced gamma waves, affecting the manager's brain before causing the explosion. Officials have assured the public that all other buildings in the area are perfectly safe. Lima butter beans. Everywhere. That's the true conspiracy. Did you well, want a saucer upgrade? Or something a little more? Personal. Okay, so there's the compounder laser. Oh, damage increases in instead of dropping off. That's useful. Rapid fire weapon greatly increases the capacity. Stay in fire, sets them on fire. Two secondary projectiles and angle with each shot. Ooh. I might do a little bit of grabbins to get a bunch of DNA before we play this again. I think I'll play this tomorrow. After uh, Wholesome vs. Live. This is pretty good. I I am so far impressed. I wonder how many missions there are. 
Probably for a bit, actually. Yeah, I love how, like, how lifesteal's default in this game. Yep, I just have to remember which is the correct button, which isn't. So you hope this game actually manages to take off. It really didn't have the impact that it did back in the day. I think it's just because the PS2 was just inundated with similar games that back in the day, this, compared to Ratchet and Clank, I would say this, Ratchet and Clank and D Jack and Daxter, this game is humorous, but not as good. Whereas the gameplay for this has aged actually really well. So re-releasing it, you know, 15 years later actually is fine. It looks great. It plays well enough. I would love to see a, a modernized version with like new mechanics and some other stuff just to make it a little bit more interesting. I will admit, I'm not sure if I really like the UFO segments. They're not super exciting to me. They're okay, but I kind of prefer being on foot and exploring and doing some other stuff. But still, I I don't know. It's a cool game. It does make me question how much of this I have left.